Hello, beautiful people. Welcome back to vlog. It's been a long time and I know a lot of you are like, what's going on? Where are you? And I don't want to go into too much detail in the intro because I don't want to have a sad tone for this vlog. But mm, the last six months, my last six months were just a pain in the ass. <laughs> but there was just a lot of things happening. My body wasn't okay. My mental health was horrible. Um, I had to deal with family stuff and every time I thought, okay, now it's going to be better, something else happened that, yeah, just wasn't so nice. Too much to share live on the internet. But now I think I am finally in a place where I can like, you know the saying, no rain, no flowers? For me, it rained a lot and now it's summer and I feel like I can finally bloom again and like enjoy life and just be. It's June, beginning of June. What day is today actually? 8th of June. I was traveling a lot this month. I went to London and to Capri and to Portugal and Barcelona. There was a lot of um, work involved in that. Um, I just got back on Monday from Barcelona where I went to Primavera Sound for the third or fourth time, which was amazing. Um, I saw Fred again live, which just absolute joy. The crowd was insane, everyone, even with their like phones out, was having just the best time. The last two days I just did a little bit of reset, you know, doing things like laundry and cleaning and <clears throat> organizing things. I also did some work. I have some, had a really exciting job in Capri and it's gonna come out, I think this month. <clears throat> and I'm super happy about it. I, I'm probably gonna talk about it the next couple days. Um, and yeah. So today is my best friend's birthday and she's going to have a little barbecue with friends in the park and I think it's going to be really cool because the weather is amazing. It's going to be 29 degrees in Berlin today and we're just going to have a little, you know, barbecue in the park, which I love. I have, I thrifted this dress. Where did I put it? Well, it just looks like a blob of black fabric, but it's this kind of strapless bendo dress with asymmetrical ending. It's from one of my favorite brands to thrift, Kukai, Kukai. I have a lot of dresses from them that I got either on eBay or in the thrift shop sometimes when I'm lucky, but I don't have enough boobies to wear this dress. <laughs> it's just too big for me in the cleavage area. So I think I want to alter it today. I made my two little things to make it tighter. And now I realized that I have white yarn in my sewing machine. So I should change it to black. Let's see how it fits. Damn. Just, just stepped into all the needles. And let me tell you, this is not the first time this happened. Well. <coughs> okay, first of all, it should be even tighter. And the lines are not straight. They like go this way, but. Hmm. I think this is actually pretty cute. They go perfectly with the belt and the little studs. I love this one. And this one. 
because we're, I mean, I'm a year older than her, but we're all slowly approaching a different number in the front, so. They were all closed up yesterday, and now they're just. Hey girl, ich weiß noch, als ich dich das erste Mal sah. Ich kam in dein Geschäft und du warst da an der Bar. Mit einer schönen roten Rose im Haar standst du da. Ooh girl, damit ich deinen Namen weiß. Hast du gesagt, dass du Carmen heißt? Zwei, drei Piccolo lügen nicht. Du hast gesagt, dass du mich magst, dass du nicht fragst, nur handelst. Oh, wenn's dir nicht Und das ist ganz bestimmt nicht wegen dem Geld. Someone's really hungover. Her name's Mel. Craving some greasy fried food. It was really nice. I just had. One too many drinks. Mm. Eye drops are life changers. Ah. Oh. Good morning, guys. <coughs> My voice is still pretty bad, but it's okay. I had a great weekend so far. Today is Sunday and my heart is beating up to my throat because I have a, an appointment in an hour, it's a fitting, and I am very nervously and anxiously excited about it. Um, more nervous than anxious, but still, <laughs> I'm so excited! <laughs> um, yeah. I'm gonna put on some music and dance a little bit, get my mood going, because that's always what I do. I feel like I'm in the Devil Wears Prada, like live motion. It's the next day, 10 a.m. right now, and I am going back for a refitting, but it'll be fine. I did it. I did it. Now my actual plan isn't working. I wanted to drop off some eight millimeter footage today. But now that I have to wait for the stuff to get here, so I can't do that today. But I hope I can do it tomorrow. I have to drop it tomorrow, latest by 2 p.m. You can't see, but everything's a mess because I rushed in and out, of course. So what I'm gonna do now is fix the mess. Then I haven't worn my wig in a couple months, and I. Remember that I did not store it properly, so I have to get the wig and Give it some shape and like, you know Bring it back to life because it's been laying crusted up in some box I basically took the next few weeks off just have Really small projects planned just because I feel like I really disconnected with what I love doing and I really want to try and get the love back for what I'm doing. This always looks very weird, just having a bunch of hair lying around. So this is my favorite one that I wish I had a second and third one from, but I cannot find it anywhere again on the internet. This is the same one in blonde, which just looks really fake. 
and then I also have this one which I really like the color of it's like the same color as this one this one's wet right now but this one is a lot longer and not I like it short short you know so I just gave this one a little water refreshment and some like leave in moisturizing stuff because she was she was very very dry <coughs> I'm still waiting for my look to be delivered but I'm so excited friends it's a rainy Friday it's a light summer rain which I actually appreciate because it kind of catches all the pollen I'm just getting ready like I did my skincare can I do my makeup and then I'm gonna pack a lot of different stuff because we're going into the studio today to um, do some like Polaroids for our agency and then I also have to have my YSL look to shoot and then yeah we're just hanging out by the studio and then it's the weekend This is so crazy for me. So, yeah, I have these two pages in the New Glacia from our beautiful trip with Chanel to Capri. And we have some underwater and some beautiful flowers, and of course, a mirror selfie. And then we have Chiara and more Sabrina and a lot of Chanel and. This is so crazy! A big thank you to my agency and Chris trusting me with this, letting me shoot everything on film. Wow, it's my pictures. I am beyond excited about this. I don't know, it's just, you know, like. <laughs> Photographer Melanie Kiewak. That's me! <laughs> <laughs> 